she's a fashion influencer and one of the stars of the Real Housewives of New York City. But when Cy De Silva is not navigating Manhattan's social scene, she's at her home in Brooklyn. And Cy gave us a look inside her stunning townhouse as part of Hoda and Jenna's house tour, including the most coveted corner of her home, the closet. <laughs> We're going to chat with her in a moment, but first, take a look. Welcome to Brooklyn, New York. This is my little oasis, and I cannot wait to show you my Brooklyn townhome. Let's go. Welcome to my living room. Now, this is a very cozy space. When I was designing it, I wanted it to feel very inviting. So I went ahead and put some photos up of my family. Now, this is the kitchen. This is where I do all the hosting. I've had the ladies from Roni over. Hello. Hello. Welcome to me, Casa. We've had a chef over. We do lots and lots of cooking. Hi, I'm Koenig. I'm the chef here tonight. So we're making sure you go into like everything and... Oh, we're gonna love it. Oh, yeah. He's married. Oh, okay, never mind. Anyhow, <laughs> I'll get a drink. I have an elevator. So let's be fancy. Let's take it upstairs. Typically, I use it for storage because when you live in New York, you use every nook and cranny for storage. I mean, hence the treadmill. Welcome to my bathroom. I have to show you something in my bathroom that I love so much. So we have a mirror on the outside, but when we flip it, I mean skincare obsessed. If I had to take one thing from here, I just would take the whole cabinet. <laughs> Hey, welcome to my closet. This is where the magic happens, for me at least. So right now, I am going through a serious white button down phase. I mean, as you can see, there are tons. And for some reason, I'm still gravitated to buying more white button downs. I know, I have to stop. Let me also show you some of my favorite bags. Now, I have this adorable little Fendi bag. And I know you're wondering what can fit in here, but I have to be honest, a lipstick, an AirPod. It's almost like, you know, when your bag has a baby. These Prada loafers at one time, I was going through a phase where I had to wear socks and loafers. I'm still very much so in that phase, but these are some of my favorites. This was the very first splurge that I made on myself when my blog took off, and I was very, very excited about it. It is a medium Chanel classic with caviar leather, and of course, a good pair of sunglasses, ladies, because you never know when you might need to throw some shade. Am I right? This is my daughter's room. This room is very, very fun. Um, I, a friend of mine is an artist and she came over one day with the tiniest little, tiniest little brush and she hand drew all of the drapes and the books that are all over the walls. This is my daughter's collection of, what are these called? Well, but they're also your children, she told me. <laughs> Welcome to my son's room. He's a really into Legos and every one of his creations is sitting on our dresser. The room is a wildlife theme. He's really into the jungle. We did a campfire on the floor, just something that he can use his imagination. And we have a dog, his name is Yoshi. They cuddle all night long. We really made this room very creative and he loves it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me in Brooklyn, but it is wine 30 and it is time for me to wind down. I'll see you ladies soon. Cheers. 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 I'm moving in. <laughs> you won't in. even notice me and my children and my She'll husband. Be, I'll put them somewhere. will be sleeping in the closet. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are more than welcome to come over anytime. Okay, Sai, so you have an, a strict no shoe policy, is that right? Yes, yes, there's absolutely no shoes in my home, I but I think that. that's like the New York way. I, yeah. That was how yeah. we were too. But now if you have a party, sometimes we would let people, because it really ruins an outfit. <laughs> yes, I was told that it ruins an outfit, but I have a white rug that I do not want to get dirty. Yeah. And I just think shoes should come off. Or I have booties. Yeah. Mm. I can oh, offer okay. booties. Okay, offering booties is you're generous. So, you're so fashionable. Do you think it all works together? I mean, I 
I told you I'm obsessed with your shoes and your clothes. I've been following you. A lot of us have for, for years. And then now you have your home. Like, I mean, does it all kind of work together? Both have to be yeah, elevated? Yeah, I, I, I think 100%. It definitely has to come together and just feel, I don't know, for me, I'm very aesthetic. Yeah. Like, that's that, that aesthetic vibe. So whatever I'm wearing also needs to transition into where I live. I love that. Um, okay, I got to come to your house in 2015. 2015. Wow. Your daughter, London, was three. She's here now. She's adorable. She's, she's 11 adorable. going on 12 now. 11 wow. going on 12. Such a big girl. There but she I... is. London, remember when we did that or not really? Because you were three. three. I don't remember anything. <laughs> we're coming over, both of you. We're coming over yes, for coming. sure. We have to hear about your podcast. Yes, oh, yes, yes, yes. I'm coming out with a podcast with my very best friend. It's called Harder Than We Thought because life is harder than we thought. Yeah. And it's just um, best friend banter in our 40s, you know, successful careers, marriage, she's dating, and Fun. all the things in between. So it's going to be a really good Incredible. podcast. Definitely take a listen. It'll be out very soon. Perfect. Amazing, Sai. Thank you. And y'all, it's you, oh, if thanks. you want more of Sai, which I know everybody She's does, so great. you can go to The Real Housewives of New York City. It's on our sister network, Bravo, and it's also streaming on Peacock.